In the last video, we find out the temperature dependence of equilibrium constant and we reached a new equation that is a want of equation. After that, we found the integrated um, want of equation. Okay, anyway, in this video, we are find, or in this class, we are finding out the want of equation in terms of Kc or we are finding out the relation between the want of equation and the Kc. For that, we are using uh, the equation we have already discussed earlier. First one, we know that the Kp is equal to Kc in raised to Rt, Kc into Rt raised to delta n. We already conducted the digital equation. Taking the log ln, Kp is equal to ln Kc into Rt raised to delta n. What is log a into b? Definitely, it will be log a plus b. That is given here ln Kc plus ln Rt raised to delta n. After that, what will be log a raised to x? That is a x log a. Anyway, ln kc plus ln r raised to delta n plus ln t raised to delta n then that is ln kp is equal to ln kc plus delta n ln r plus delta n ln t okay anyway this equation is a differentiating with respect to the temperature and differentiate the anyway i am only seeing the steps here d l n k p by d t which is equal to d l n k c by d t plus delta n by t. If we are differentiating with respect to the t certain terms will be vanishes. d l n k c by d t which is equal to d l n k p by d t minus delta n by delta n by t. That is the delta k c in the to the We know the equation 7 already explained the equation on we know the equation 7 d l n k p by d t is equal to delta x 0 by r t square in here value in a number of the equation one in here we equation in the room first equation will change as as d l n k c by d t which is equal to delta x 0 by r t square minus delta a n by r t after that what changes is happening here we are multiplying a term the r t to the numerator and the denominator here that is equal to delta h 0 by r t square minus delta n r t by t r t. We will change the change that is delta sorry d l n k c by d t which is equal to we will common right r t square and that is a delta h 0 minus delta n r t divided by that is divided by all divided by r t square. It is not only for this term that this is all divided by r t square. We know that delta h 0 is equal to delta e 0 plus delta n r t. That is a delta e 0 can be written as delta h 0 minus delta n r t. After that d l n k c by d t which is equal to in the no equation that is but now look in the in the getting delta h 0 minus delta n r t all divided by r t square and in the in the that is a delta e 0 is equal to delta h 0 minus delta n r t in the again i can rewrite the above equation as d l n k c by d t which is equal to delta e 0 divided by r t square okay so this is the uh, final equation of the number then integrating the above equation within the limit at t1 the limit um, the corresponding kc will be the kc1 at a t2 the corresponding constant equilibrium constant will be the kc2 similar to equation 7 we can write the equation as ln kc2 by kc1 which is equal to delta e0 by r into t2 minus t1 divided by t1 t2 that is log k2 to c by log k c21 which is equal to delta e0 divided by 2.303 r into uh, the t2 minus t1 divided by t1 t2 equation have already explained here i don't know so that is the relationship between want of equation in terms of or want of equation is written in terms of kc that equation is mainly del, uh, d l n k c by d t which is equal to delta e 0 by r t square. Okay, I uh, think it's clear for you. Then we are entering into the next section, no, not next section, uh, the next um, uh, dependence that is the pressure dependence of the equilibrium constant. 
രണ്ട് ഡിപ്പെൻഡൻസ് ആണ് നമ്മൾ എക്ലിബ്രിയം കോൺസ്റ്റന്റ് പറയുന്നത് ഫസ്റ്റ് വൺ ഇസ് എ ടെമ്പറേച്ചർ ഡിപ്പെൻഡൻസ് വിച്ച് ഇസ് ഓൾറെഡി ഡിസ്കസ് ആൻഡ് ആഫ്റ്റർ ദ നൗ വി ആർ ഡിസ്കസിംഗ് വാട്ട് ഇസ് എ പ്രഷർ ഡിപ്പെൻഡൻസ് ഓഫ് ദ ഇക്വിലിബ്രിയം കോൺസ്റ്റന്റ് ഇനി നമ്മൾ ഒരു പാർട്ട് ആയിട്ട് എ ബി സി എന്നായിട്ടാണ് പറയുന്നത് ഫസ്റ്റ് വൺ എ ഇഫക്ട് ഓഫ് പ്രഷർ ഓൺ കെ പി ഫസ്റ്റ് ഫൈൻഡിങ് ഔട്ട് ദ റിലേഷൻഷിപ്പ് ഓർ എഫക്ട് ഓഫ് പ്രഷർ ഓൺ കെ പി വി നോ ദാറ്റ് ദി ഇക്വേഷൻ ഡെൽറ്റ ജി സീറോ ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു മൈനസ് ആർ ടി എൽ എൻ കെ പി ഓർ എൽ എൻ കെ പി ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു മൈനസ് എ ഡെൽറ്റ ജി സീറോ ബൈ ആർ ടി ഹിയർ ദ ഡെൽറ്റ ജി സീറോ ഡിപ്പെൻഡ്സ് ഓൺലി ഓൺ ടെമ്പറേച്ചർ ആൻഡ് ദ കെ പി ഡിപ്പെ ഓൾസോ ഡിപ്പെൻഡ്സ് ഓൺ ടെമ്പറേച്ചർ ആൻഡ് ഇൻഡിപെൻഡൻറ്റ് ഓൺ പ്രഷർ ആൻഡ് ഡിഫറൻഷിയേറ്റ് വിത്ത് റെസ്പെക്ട് അറ്റ് കോൺസ്റ്റൻറ്റ് പ്രഷർ with respect to okay with respect at a constant temperature you can see you can you will get the equation as dln kp by dt dp at the constant temperature which is equal to minus d by dp of delta g0 by rt at a constant temperature which is equal to zero that is the effect of pressure on kp next is the effect of pressure on kp it's not kp it's kc okay the effect of pressure on kc we know that kp is equal to kc into rt always to delta i here the kp depends on temperature and independent on pressure and kc depends also depends on temperature and independent on pressure anyway the equation can be written as kc is equal to kp ആർ ടി റേസ് ടു മൈനസ് ഡെൽറ്റ എം നമ്മൾ എന്ത് ചെയ്യും തിരിച്ചു കൊണ്ടുപോകും ദെൻ എൽ എൻ കെ സി വിച്ച് ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു എൽ എൻ കെ പി ഇൻ ടു ആർ ടി ഹർ റേസ് ടു ഡെൽ മൈനസ് ഡെൽറ്റ എം മൈനസ് വരുന്നത് എങ്ങനെയാണ് നമ്മൾ ഇതിനെ നിങ്ങൾ തിരിച്ചെടുക്കുമ്പോൾ വരുന്ന മൈനസിനെ നമ്മൾ കൊണ്ടുവന്നതാണ് അറ്റ് ഇസ് എൽ എൻ കെ പി പ്ലസ് എൽ എൻ ആർ ടി റേസ് ടു മൈനസ് ഡെൽറ്റ എൻ അറ്റ് ഇസ് എൽ എൻ കെ സി ഇസ് ഈക്വൽ ടു എൽ എൻ കെ പി മൈനസ് ഡെൽറ്റ എൻ ln rt then after that differentiate with at with respect to pressure at a constant temperature yeah okay d ln kc by dp at a constant temperature is equal to d ln kp by dp at a constant temperature minus delta n into d ln rt by dp at a constant temperature ഓക്കെ ഞാനൊരു കാര്യം നേരത്തെ വിട്ടു ഞാനൊരു എഡിറ്റ് ചെയ്തതൊരു മിസ്റ്റേക്ക് വന്നു എന്ന് എനിക്ക് തോന്നുന്നു ഇവിടെ നമ്മൾ ഡിഫറൻഷിയേറ്റ് വിത്ത് റെസ്പെക്ട് ടു പി എന്നുണ്ടായിരുന്നു അല്ലേ ഞാനത് നേരത്തെ എഡിറ്റ് ചെയ്ത് ഒഴിവാക്കിയിട്ടുണ്ടായിരുന്നു നോട്ടസ് ഇങ്ങനെ തന്നെയാണ് ഡിഫറൻഷിയേറ്റ് വിത്ത് റെസ്പെക്ട് ടു ടി എ പി അറ്റ് കോൺസ്റ്റൻറ്റ് ടെമ്പറേച്ചർ ഓക്കെ അതവിടെ ചെയ്തത് മാറിപ്പോയ ഓക്കെ ഇനി വേ വി ക്യാൻ കം ബാക്ക് ടു ദിസ് ഇക്വേഷൻ എക്കെ ഞാൻ എന്ത് ചെയ്തു ടേമിനെ അല്ലേ ഞാൻ വൺ എന്ന് ടേം ആക്കി കൊടുത്തു ദിസ് ഇസ് ദ ടേം ടു Since the KP is independent on temperature, we know we can take or then the equation, this first term and the second term will be 0. Then dLN KC by dP at a constant temperature will be equal to 0. That is KC is independent on pressure. Therefore, we find out the KC is also independent on pressure. That is the relationship between the effect of pressure on KC. Okay. Then, Next is effect of pressure on K chi. We know the equation Kp is equal to Ka, K chi into P raised to delta n. That is K chi is equal to Kp into P raised to minus delta n. That is ln K chi which is equal to ln Kp minus delta n ln P. After that differentiate uh, with respect to P at a constant temperature. That is a D ln K chi by dP at a constant temperature. which is equal to dln kp by dp at a constant temperature minus delta n into dln p by dp at a constant temperature then after that uh, write the equation write the first term as uh, the number 1 and the, then this term is a number 2 since kp is independent on the temperature we can say dln kp by dp at a constant temperature is equal to zero that is a dln k chi by dp at a constant temperature is equal to 
Therefore, we can write the DLN key chi by dt at constant temperature is equal to minus delta L, ln into 1 by p. Okay, that is the DLN key chi by p into uh, at constant temperature is equal to minus delta n by p. The above sh shows that the key chi depends upon the pressure. The above, the, that means this is not the key chi is not equal to 0. Okay. The delta n should not, not the delta n never be you know, zero. So the above equation shows that the k chi is depends upon the pressure when delta n not equal to zero. Delta n is zero available because the number of the products in the reactants in the number of moles in the kila zero anan oka parayapachilla. So anyway, delta n will be not equal to zero. Therefore, we can see that dl k chi by dp at constant temperature will be equal to minus delta n by Okay, so that is all about the dependence of pressure on uh, equilibrium constant. Okay, so just to revise the paria, first in the effect of pressure on KP and the paranet. So, the differentiate pressure in the table with differentiate in the constant temperature. The term of it. Okay, after that effect of pressure on KC in the way. The case independent on pressure that is L K C by dp at the constant temperature will be equal to 0 which means that K C is independent on pressure. After that effect of pressure on K chi in the K chi in the it depends K chi is depends upon the pressure of why just because you are getting a value here the L K chi by dp at constant temperature will be equal to minus delta L by P. Definitely, uh, definitely the delta n not, may not be equal to 0. So, this is the equation part of this module. So, I think it's clear for you now. Okay. So, see you in the next video.